What we're showing you now is very early. It is a small number and we may see some big changes, but let's take a look at what we've got so far. Outsider, one of the big buzzwords of this election. About half of Republican voters so far this year are looking for an outsider as their candidate, and Donald Trump has been their choice. There's no big difference tonight in this. In fact, 69% of those voters say that they are with the New York billionaire. Take a look at how that stacks up. Everybody else is far behind in that category. The other big word that has been a buzzword so far, angry. The angry voter, and they are speaking clearly tonight as well. Take a look at how this stacks up. You've got 51% of those who say they feel angry about the way the federal government is functioning. They are with Donald Trump tonight. 22% are with Senator Ted Cruz. Marco Rubio gets 20 and Carson gets four. The values voters, they have been strong for Ted Cruz throughout the cycle so far, and they are once again tonight as well. Shares my values is in fact the top quality that Nevada Republicans are looking for in a candidate. Four in 10 of them are supporting Ted Cruz. And there are the numbers that you see on the screen and how they stack up in that category. We are seeing a higher turnout tonight. Late deciders. We always see the crush in these primaries and caucuses at the end. Everybody driving to get that vote out. Cruz and Rubio have done pretty well with the late deciders in the early races. Did Cruz's troubles over the past few days have any impact on that? So far, the late deciders, once again here, seem to be breaking for Marco Rubio. 38% of them going in his direction this evening. So we're going to keep crunching these numbers, taking a look at what comes in. We'll get another group of them coming up in a few minutes. Brett, back to you now, though. Brett and Megan. All right, more. Martha, thank you. So we saw that Donald Trump basically gets the outsider vote walking away tonight. But for voters who want someone who has experience, Senator Rubio is winning them over. Take a look at the numbers. He gets 55% of those. Cruz gets 28. John Kasich gets nine. He did not have high hopes for Nevada tonight, but Kasich, with his long resume, nonetheless did not get the experience vote here, which is interesting. Trump gets five on that measure. So we're also seeing a record number tonight for the voters who say they're angry at the federal government. 57% of the Nevada vote. South Carolina, that number was at 40%. New Hampshire, it was 39 and Iowa, it was 42 So the angry voter seems to be growing as we go through this process. Now look at this, Hispanic voters with a positive message tonight for Donald Trump. This is the first contest where we have a calculable amount of Republicans. And despite his stand on immigration, Hispanic voters are only about one in 10 tonight. But of them, 41% are with Donald Trump, 29% for Rubio, 16 for Cruz, both of whom are of Cuban descent. And John Kasich gets five of the Hispanic voters in terms of percentage. So very interesting 